Good evening, I'm Pallavi Ghosh. Our top story continues to remain the 10-hour-long ED probe inside Sanjay Rao's residence, which began early this morning. Since then, he's been detained. The questioning is still going on. We are keeping a close watch on all the developments. Certainly, it's been a day filled with drama in the Maharashtra politics, and his detention is bound to have political ramifications. This happened after 10 hours of questioning. Sanjay Raut has been taken to the ED office where he's been grilled on the Patra Chol land scam case in Mumbai. The ED has raided Sanjay Raut's home after he skipped its summons twice. Sanjay Raut is under the ED lens in connection with the money laundering case, which is linked to alleged irregularities in the redevelopment of a chol in Mumbai. However, Chief Sena MP has already denied that there was any wrongdoing and he alleges that he is being targeted because of political vendetta. शिवसेना इतकी कमजोर नहीं है परी शिवसेना काय है यार तुम्हें पाहता है अरे बैठना तो बैठना मत आपने तो प्लेस में आए कर महाराज के पास पलट रहा है महाराज का बैठना है हिंदी में लौटता है हिंदी में लौटता है सर कार्रवाई मेरे खिलाफ मेरे खिलाफ जिस प्रकार से झूठी कार्रवाई झूठे कागज झूठे विडांस लोगों को मार मार कर पीट पीट कर बनाए जा रहे हैं ये सिर्फ महाराष्ट्र को कमजोर करने के लिए शिवसेना को कमजोर करने के लिए लेकिन शिवसेना कमजोर नहीं होगी महाराष्ट्र कमजोर नहीं होगा दूसरी बात संजय राउत झुकेगा नहीं ना पार्टी छोड़ेगा ना शिवसेना छोड़ेगा संजय राउत को जो ईडी का समन आया था उसमें लिखा था पत्राचाल की कार्रवाई उनको पूछो कौन सा पेपर मिला पत्राचाल का मोबाइल नीचे करेगा भाई सिंगल डॉक्यूमेंट पत्राचाल का मिला और जो डॉक्यूमेंट लेके गए वो डॉक्यूमेंट राहुल साहब ने इनकम टैक्स और राज्यसभा के जो फॉर्म भरा जाता है सब सबमिट किया हुआ है अभी देखो ऊपर गलत कार्रवाई करेंगे झूठे डॉक्यूमेंट बनाएंगे जबरदस्ती से किसी से साइन लिया होगा इस पे कुछ भी कर सकते हैं फिर भी उनको लगा लगेगा कि संजय राउत अभी झुकेगा सवाल ही नहीं आता झुकने का फांसी भी दो तो भी शिवसेना नहीं छोड़ेंगे उद्धव ठाकरे को नहीं छोड़ेंगे बारह सब के सैनिक है Okay, let me just go across to all my colleagues on the ground. This is Vinaya Deshpande outside the ED office. Herman is also going to join us later. Vinaya, any developments? It's been almost more than an hour, I think, since he's been inside. Yana, sir, one minute. Yes, he has been inside for almost an hour now. And, uh, you know, I am, uh, I am also being joined by Sunil Raut, who's Sanjay Raut's brother. Uh, in this, he's uh, speaking with us in just one minute. We will try and understand from him how did the whole situation go. Sunil Raut ji, please tell us that he is going to be in the case of the case. I have अरे बाबा किस केस में लेके जा रहा हूँ उनको भी पता नहीं है दिल्ली से आएंगे तब हम लोग बोलेंगे ऐसा उनका कहना है समंस में लिखा है आपको ईडी ऑफिस में लेके जा रहे ईडी लेके जा रहे लेकिन सर क्या उनको बोला है कि अरेस्ट करेंगे कौन से मैटर में क्या है वही उनको भी पता नहीं मैं कौन से मैटर में अरेस्ट करेंगे ईडी को उन्होंने सुबह सात बजे मैत्री बंगले का सर्च वारंट लेके आए थे बीस बाईस जन आए सर्च लिया डॉक्यूमेंट चेक किया लेकिन जो जिस लास्ट समझ में जो लिखा था कि पत्राचाल लेकिन पत्राचाल का कोई डॉक्यूमेंट्स मिला नहीं इसीलिए और किसी भी केस में अटकाएंगे अटकाने के लिए ही ये सब कुछ चल रहा है माननीय उद्धव साहेब ठाकरे के निरस्ट है उनको कमजोर करना है इसलिए संजय राउत को अरेस्ट करेंगे लेकिन अरेस्ट भी करेंगे या फांसी भी देंगे तो भी संजय राउत झुकेंगे नहीं शिवसेना छोड़ेंगे नहीं और उद्धव साहब उद्धव साहब ठाकरे का साथ नहीं छोड़ेंगे लेकिन क्या कोई डॉक्यूमेंट सीज किया गया कोई डॉक्यूमेंट सीज किया नहीं है और डॉक्यूमेंट जो था जो हमने इनकम टैक्स में सबमिट किया था जो डॉक्यूमेंट संजय राउत साहब ने राज्यसभा के इलेक्शन में प्रोड्यूस किया था सब डॉक्यूमेंट लेके गए नहीं हमसे किसी पूछताछ नहीं हुई नहीं 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 कोई नहीं तो दिस वाज सुनील राउत स्पीकिंग टू सीएनएन न्यूज़ 18 से आंसरिंग ऑल आर क्वेश्चंस 
saying that there is no clarity as yet about which case exactly is it on which uh, the summons have been sent. He is saying that even they will come to know only when the officials from Delhi arrive. So right now, Sunil Raut making a very big claim. He is saying this is not necessarily about Patra Chal case. This is uh, something that they themselves don't know about, that they have not been told about. The old summons that were served to them, even the summons that were served to them uh, with respect to today, uh, there has been uh, you know, no detail that has been given to them. There has been no seizure of documents. Uh, and whatever documents they had asked, they have opened up the house for them. So important statements there by Sunil Raut, Sanjay Raut's younger brother and MLA uh, claiming that there's no clarity about whether this is Patra Chol alone or whether there is anything else with respect to questioning. He has said that in the house there was no questioning, in the house there was no seizure and right now as well the statement hasn't yet been recorded. There is no clarity on whether there will be an arrest okay. or not. They haven't yet been told about it. They're waiting for some senior officials from Delhi. But, but you know, uh, uh, Vinaya, uh, obviously listening to what Sanjay Raut has been saying, he doesn't seem to be having a fear or, uh, uh, you know, a worry about being arrested. Rather, it seems he actually wants to be arrested to score a political point. From here on, how do you see the politics in Maharashtra then playing out? Oh, well, the, yes, you're right. In, in fact, uh, you know, Sanjay Raut had been claiming for quite some time now that he was under the scanner and that he was threatened of arrest. In fact, he also said that six months ago, the BJP approached him saying that if he did not change loyalties, then there would be action that would be taken against not just him, but against all those who stick on to Uddhav Thakre. Also, we have seen Sanjay Raut making statements claiming that he is not going to change loyalties. Even if uh, they, he dies, he is not going to bow down. Uh, so this is something that will definitely be used in the politics of Maharashtra. Firstly, in the regional politics, we will see it playing in the parliament as well tomorrow as the parliamentary session is on. And within Maharashtra as well, we will see that the Shiv Zena, specifically Uddhav Thakre, at a time when he enjoys quite a sympathy wave for the way uh, several Shiv Sena MLAs have deserted him and have gone with Eknath Shinde, will try to build up on this narrative. He mm -hmm. has said in the past as well, uh, you know, in fact, the recent interview that Uddhav Thakre gave to Samna, he also said that uh, Sanjay Raut himself was under the scanner and he was under pressure uh, to change sides and that this was an effort to finish off the Sena and to finish off the Marathi Manus. So the whole linking of this issue to Marathi Manus, Marathi Asmita, linking it to a larger issue of finishing off the regional players, of finishing off the opposition parties at the national level. For all these narratives, this uh, specific current detention, likely arrest, is going to be used by the Shiv Sena and possibly by other regional parties as well. Okay, let me get in a word in also from Herman, who's still outside the ED office. Herman,